Hello and welcome back to my channel. As I am recording this, we are an hour and a half away from the full 24 member Triple S debut, which uh, they're going to be doing, I think, once a year, kind of like an NCT deal that they do every two years with everyone together. Now, it does seem like they kind of like fast tracked the end of this group, the last like Eight members seem to be very, very much fast-tracked. So we have a request here from Mike to do the Triple S Next uh, Just Do It performance video. Now, this unit didn't get an album, right? It's basically just this single. Uh, so we have four members here, S17 Lin, uh, S18 Jubin, S19 Heon, and S20 Xian. Now, we also have s21 through 24 announced and they will all be together in this upcoming uh debut in just an hour and a half i found it interesting just because every every subunit seemed to have this larger rollout kind of deal and this one slipped by me i know this came out a while ago but it was just because it didn't have really the fanfare of the other ones the grander fanfare outside of waves and whatnot uh so i find it just very interesting maybe you could tell me a little bit more of that but I'm sure that as I post this, uh, you know, the Triple S has already debuted as their full group, which I'm also very excited for as a kind of, as I've said before, a big fan of theirs, but not a hardcore fan. I don't check out every signal, but more kind of recaps on them that we've watched over on Patreon and Fourth Wall. We've watched their Badge War, some, you know, plenty of other variety. And I do know the majority of their names. Um, and I'm excited for Badge War uh, 2. But I wouldn't say I'm hardcore to where I know everything that's going on exactly with this group. But I think I have my hand somewhat on the pulse. It's like, it's somewhere on the forearm. It's like not on the wrist where your pulse is, but it's like I'm on the forearm of Triple S, basically. Still not over that canceled Chicago show. I'll bring it up every chance I get, but I'm I'm still upset. Okay, so we have Lin, Jubin, Heon, and Xion in this group. I'm not really going to be able to pick them up. We have short descriptions here. Lin, short hair, Japanese. Jubin, the new magne of Triple S. Although I think in S21 to 24, we did get someone who's even younger. I think we got the youngest member in that final uh, allotment of members. And Heian S19 kind of looks like Youngin, which, okay, we'll look out for that. Um, Xion has a really cute voice. Kind of crazy how high pitched it is so this is a really short video which is why i kind of looked up if there's anything else that this group did in terms of songs or performances it's only two and a half minutes long but this seems to be it for the most part uh so we will figure it out let's get to it i thought this was very appropriate to get this request done right on the the eve the hour eve of the full group debut which is awesome because honestly I mean, they had my favorite album last year, but they're putting out some of the best music in the biz right now. So let's go. Oh my god, okay, yeah, Lin is very noticeable. Ooh. Oh my god, she looks so confident. Oh, they're light on their feet. Damn, I really like this choreography too. Oh wait, girl on the left looks so familiar. I so I've seen her. I've definitely seen her in some of their stuff before. I can't remember who that is though. So familiar. I see that face a lot. 
half of my Twitter and Instagram are is triple S stuff, so I've definitely seen you a lot. These are high pitch voice, yes. It does kind of look like Young Moon. Oh god, this song really just coalesced. She's high kicking all over the place. She's like hmm. She's like a mix of Young Moon and Yoram a little bit. Very pretty. As someone with that mix would be. <laughs> oh, I really like the choreography of this song. It is also just exhausting looking. What are these whistle notes I'm hearing? Lynn is slender and tall and just seemingly a very good dancer. She makes a very strong impression just in this performance video. Like, definitely, I'd say the most notable here for sure. Uh, and it's one thing that I was interested in with these subunits is they all had a very particular flavor. They all had a very particular image that they were putting out there. And I was wondering, with it being called like Triple S Next, like what was the idea necessarily behind this one or what their image was? I wish I had more to check out here in terms of this this unit here, uh, but we don't, unfortunately. So this is basically just kind of a send up. Let's check this out before the full debut kind of deal. And now I have. And now you are watching this probably after debut. So hopefully it is really good. I will be there. Check out my Patreon on my fourth wall for lots of extra Triple S content. There's plenty on there. Album reactions, the new album will be on there for sure, as the previous are all on there and plenty of variety too. Thank you guys so much for checking this out with me. Thank you so much for the request. And I'll see you next time.